Third, welcome to the first ever PTL on the water. Coming to you live from the top deck of the Gateway Clippers Empress. What a gorgeous day to be out here. It really is. This is the official kickoff of the KDKA TV Turkey Fund, the 41st year. And every year we try and do it bigger and better to really help as many people as possible. So in our 41st year, we said, hey, Right. Let's just let's just run out a boat for the day. I don't know why not. I don't let's know how, we, how we're gonna top this next year. Like I'm really. We're know. gonna do it on the Steel Phantom at Pennywood. Oh my gosh! That's All where right. it's gonna take place. Well, anyway, today we're trying to get your attention by being out on the water, and the food bank does such a, such a great job all year long of getting people's attention. Yeah, they really want to make it accessible and they want to make sure that people know they are there mm -hmm. for them when they are in need. And Mikey Hood, I don't know if you're still in the corn costume, but oh, you're going to talk so. about the great social media <laughs> outreach that's happening with the food bank. <laughs> Heather, David, it has the juice. Yeah, you're probably wondering, your eyes are not deceiving you. I am dressed like a giant piece of corn, but it's all for a very good reason. I'm here with Dana DeSantis from the Pittsburgh, the Greater Pittsburgh Community Food Bank. And Dana, you're in charge of all of the marketing. So we're going to talk about why I'm dressed like this. But first, talk about um, just what families are facing this year uh, for Thanksgiving. Yeah, so with inflation, we've seen a big surge of people coming in and needing our assistance. Um, so people that can't afford to go and get groceries themselves uh, can't pay for, uh, you know, gas or anything. Um, so they come to us to get the help that they need. Yeah, and, and how does something like this help out? Uh, well, it raises awareness us obviously um, and helps us to you know feed our community um, as well as you know just allow those people to get meals on their table yeah and you've really taken to social media you yeah. guys have opened up your own TikTok account so tell yeah. me about that yeah so we started the TikTok account in like mid-may ish yeah. um, and ever since there we've just had a really good time with it um, we have volunteers you know run around in different costumes as well as our staff um, and we had you know Kim Hayward in a couple uh, weeks Weeks ago, a month, month ago, I think, by now, um, and he did the viral corn TikTok, which is why you're in your lovely outfit today. Well, I would tell you, watching the video, I mean, you guys know, you vegetables really know how to get down and drop it low. We do, yeah, we have a good time <laughs> at our facility, yeah. Uh, it's been really great. We've had a great response. So, yeah, I've had a fun time. It's really it's brightened my job a lot. So, yeah, it brings a lot of joy. Yeah, and this is, and I'm dressed like a, a, a piece of corn because this is from that viral TikTok video, <laughs> yes. right? Yes, absolutely, yeah. <laughs> and that's how it all started. Uh, pretty much, yeah, yeah. That was our first, like, kickoff uh, TikTok that we've had with Cam Hayward. He was a really good sport and got in it with us for his first ever TikTok as well. Yeah, and what are you hoping to, to gain out of all of this? Uh, really just raise awareness. We've had a couple people reach out already uh, that were getting uh, assistance from us. Uh, they reached out either through direct messages or through our comments um, and got assistance right. through our call center. Oh, well, thank yeah. you so much, Dana. You guys yeah. are doing such an amazing job yeah. with, with your marketing thank campaign. Thank you so much. And I am just like a giant piece of corn, and I'm, gonna, I'm wondering how corn dances. So I have a DJ right here. DJ, cue the music. <laughs> The corn on the cob get down like that before, Mikey, but you've got the moves. You know what? If, if you were on the fence about, like, I've you know, the juice. should I donate now? Should I wait to donate or whatever? Like, it, look at what Mikey Hood is doing to get us to donate immediately. <laughs> Mikey Hood is dressed as corn dancing on television. <laughs> like, what more does the woman have to do? <laughs> <laughs> She's all ears today. <laughs> But um, bum. Okay. All right. We are having a lot of fun, but this is a very serious cause. And coming back up here, we have the claps, we have our audience. We want to remind you again of the ways that you can donate. You can look on your screen right now. You can text Katie Turkey 22 uh, to 50155 online at katiekaa.com slash turkey fund, but there's also a QR code that's yeah, on your screen right, right down now. down there in the bottom of the screen. Am I pointing in the right spot? Yes, here. you are. Look, here. Just, oh, um, I did it. Almost. Over. over, over there you go. There. There's the QR <laughs> code. Yeah. So just scan that with your phone and then you're going to be all set to help make a donation.